drums. Um, a variation of the drums this isn't exactly how they go. Some people do it differently or whichever. But this this is how I do it. And I don't really see much uh, videos about it like this way. So we don't need that. We'll come out of this one. Start a new one. Don't save that. Right. So for this, we're going to be using Ultra Beat. Um, yeah, it's a preset VST, but I still think it's good. Personally, I like it. So sort of down down to preference when it comes to producing. So I'll use a preset. Don't want to give any of mine sounds out or anything. So just trying to find where it is now. Uh, H. Who's then? So I guess we'll have to use Tech House. Oh, there we go, Deep House Kit. So if we go to that, just empty out that, get a new one. Go to this. So with Kicks, you always start with your fours in house. It doesn't ever change. And uh, snares, what you want to do is find there you see your, your open hats always go on the middle notes, so it gives you this. So, usually, what I would do as well, I'm going to swing that swing goes on for me all the way up. So, yeah, gives you that little all swinginess in it. But what we're going to do is add another hat, a closed one to be specific. We want to go on to somewhere like this, go there and go like that. But now what we want is a clap. That's, that's my thing I'm looking for now. Can't see one. I'm gonna use this snare just as a substitute. So, anyways, this is what I got just for doing that. Usually, what I would do is mess around with it. So, like, I now know that that needs to go there just to keep that going, and then you do a repeat. Go across to the notes again. Last 16. Always had the close hats. The swing always gives it that little swing effect, like the groove that you feel in it. So that's 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 key for these deep house drums. And that's my interpretation of deep house drums.